Chapter 11 Then all Israel gathered themselves to David to Hebron, saying, Behold, we are of your bone and your flesh. In times past, even when Saul was king, it was you who led out and brought in in Israel. And the Lord your God said to you, You shall be shepherd of my people Israel, and you shall be prince over my people Israel. So all the elders of Israel came to the king to Hebron, and David made a covenant with them in Hebron before the Lord. And they anointed David king over Israel, according to the word of the Lord by Samuel. David and all Israel went to Jerusalem, the same as Jebus. And the Jebusites, the inhabitants of the land, were there. The inhabitants of Jebus said to David, You shall not come in here. Nevertheless, David took the stronghold of Zion, the same as the city of David. David said, Whoever strikes the Jebusites first shall be chief and captain. Joab the son of Zeruah went up first and was made chief. David lived in the stronghold, therefore they called it the city of David. He built the city round about, from Milo even round about, and Joab repaired the rest of the city. David grew greater and greater, for the Lord of armies was with him. Now these are the chief of the mighty men whom David had, who showed themselves strong with him in his kingdom, together with all Israel, to make him king, according to the word of the Lord concerning Israel. This is the number of the mighty men whom David had. Jashopium, the son of a Hakmonite, the chief of the thirty, he lifted up his spear against three hundred and killed them at one time. After him was Eleazar the son of Dodo the Ahohite, who was one of the three mighty men. He was with David at Pasadamim, where the Philistines were gathered together to battle, where was a plot of ground full of barley, and the people fled from before the Philistines. They stood in the midst of the plot and defended it, and killed the Philistines, and the Lord saved them by a great victory. Three of the thirty chief men went down to the rock to David, into the cave of Adullam, and the host of the Philistines were encamped in the valley of Rephaim. David was then in the stronghold, and the garrison of the Philistines was then in Bethlehem. David longed and said, O oh, that one would give me water to drink of the well of Bethlehem which is by the gate. The three broke through the host of the Philistines, and drew water out of the well of Bethlehem that was by the gate, and took it and brought it to David. But David would not drink of it, but poured it out to the Lord, and said, My God forbid me that I should do this. Shall I drink the blood of these men who have put their lives in jeopardy? For with the jeopardy of their lives they brought it. Therefore he would not drink it. These things did the three mighty men. Abishai, the brother of Joab, he was chief of the three, for he lifted up his spear against three hundred and killed them, and had a name among the three. Of the three he was more honorable than the two, and was made their captain. However, he didn't attain to the first three. Benaiah, the son of Jehida, the son of a valiant man of Kabzeel, who had done mighty deeds, he killed the two sons of Ariel of Moab, he went down also and killed a lion in the midst of a pit in the time of snow. He killed an Egyptian, a man of great stature, five cubits high, and in the Egyptian's hand was a spear like a weaver's beam, and he went down to him with a staff and plucked the spear out of the Egyptian's hand and killed him with his own spear. These things did Benaiah the son of Jehida, and had a name among the three mighty men. Behold, he was more honorable than the thirty, but didn't attain to the first three, and David set him over his guard. Also the mighty men of the armies, Asahel the brother of Joab, Elhanan the son of Dodo of Bethlehem, Shamoth the Harorite, Heles the Pelonite, Ira the son of Ikesh the Tekoite, Abiezer the Anothathite, Shibkai the Hushathite, Eli the Ahohite, Maharai the Natophathite, Heled the son of Bana the Natophathite, Ethai the son of Ribai of Gibeah, of the children of Benjamin, Benaiah the Peranothite, Hurai of the brooks of Gash, Abiel the Abarthite, 
Azameth the Baharumite, Eliba the Shalbanite, the sons of Hashem the Gizanite, Jonathan the son of Shaggy the Harite, Ahiam the son of Sakar the Hararite, Eliphal the son of Ur, Hefer the Macarathite, Ahijah the Pelonite, Hezro the Carmelite, Narai the son of Ezbi, Joel the brother of Nathan, Mibhar the son of Hagrai, Zelek the Ammonite, Naharai the Barothite, the armor bearer of Joab, the son of Zeruah, Ira the Ithrite, Garab the Ithrite, Uriah the Hittite, Zabad the son of Halai, Adonah the son of Shiza the Reubenite, a chief of the Reubenites, and thirty with him, Hanan the son of Maka, and Joshaphat the Mithnite, Uzziah the Ashtarathite, Shama and Jael the sons of Hotham the Arorite, Jediel the son of Shimri, and Joah his brother the Tizite, Eliel the Mahavite, Jerobai and Josavai the sons of Elnam, and Ithma the Moabite, Eliel and Obad, and Jasiel the Mazobite.